Hello friends, I am Dr. Anurag Saxena, Head of Department of Neurosurgery at Manipal Hospitals, Dwarka, New Delhi. 8th of June every year is celebrated as World Brain Tumor Day. The idea of celebrating this day is to spread awareness about this very serious problem and to let people know the signs and symptoms of the tumors. Brain tumors are eventually fatal if not treated in time. So it is important that patient should come timely to the doctors. Timely diagnosis will lead to timely treatment and can save many lives. Now to start with, let's talk about the signs and symptoms of the brain tumor. So patient who has continuous worsening headaches, vomiting, new onset of epilepsy attacks or seizures, any focal tingling or numbness in the arms or in one side of the body, any new problems with your vision, any new problems with your hearing, balancing problems, they, they indicate something wrong with the brain and one of the most serious causes of this problem is brain tumor. So the moment you or your dear ones realizes that he or she is suffering from this kind of problem, the first thing is to consult a neurosurgeon at the earliest so that it can be diagnosed. A simple scan will tell us whether the patient is suffering from brain tumor or not. And depending on the size, the type of the tumor and the, and the variety or the, the characteristics of the tumor on the scan, further treatment is decided. Now coming to the treatment of brain tumors. Uh, treatment of brain tumor largely depends on the size, the location and the variety of the tumor patient is suffering from. There are certain very small tumors which are very benign in nature and have a very, very slow growth rate. So those tumors can be just observed and just by serial scans like every three or six monthly scan just to make sure it is not increasing in size. And only when they increase in size or they are causing any problem to the patient, they will require some certain sort of treatment. The first step of any brain tumor treatment is surgery. The surgery is largely aimed at two main uh, important factors. One is to remove the tumor and relieve the pressure on the brain. And secondly is to find what kind of tumor it is. So whenever the tumor is taken out, it is sent for examination or histopathological examination or sometimes called as biopsy of the tumor. Depending on the biopsy of the tumor, whether it is a malignant tumor or a benign tumor, further treatment can be decided in terms of radiotherapy and sometimes chemotherapy as well. There are certain tumors, small size tumors and certain varieties of the tumors which can be treated with a new modality called as SRS or stratectic radio surgery. You must have heard about the names, the names gamma knife, cyber knife, lineic machines. These are all the technologies which are actually type of radiotherapy which are given in one or two settings to the tumor in idea or in hope that the tumor stops to grow and it shrinks further. Again, as I said, it is only possible in selected few cases. And whenever it is possible, we are able to remove or at least able to control the tumor without any surgical intervention. Benign tumor and malignant tumors have different uh, growth patterns and have different nature of the disease. Uh, certainly with malignant tumors, there is a restriction of the lifespan of the patient. And with benign tumors, if removed completely or if removed in significant amount, can, the patients can lead to a normal life. Thank you.